Hi, thought I'd make a YouTube video inside my car. I see a lot of other YouTubers do that. And it's a good idea. I mean, there's there's even lighting. The acoustics are great in here. Plus, I feel comfortable. This is my car. I I love my car. It's a 1992 Honda Civic. No no car can beat it. I'll tell you what. Of course, I don't race anybody, so I don't know that for sure. Anyways, what I'm here today to talk to you about is a controversial subject. And after, isn't that what YouTube's all about? You know, controversy. Everybody fighting each other. I'm smarter than you are. <laughs> I submit to you that if you lend your mind and your spirit to God and His Holy Spirit, you can't be wrong. All right, God is going to not lie to you. God's going to reveal Himself to you if you want God to do so. So here's something God showed me one time. I didn't have a, an opinion about the other versions of the Bible, but I had my heart open towards it. I wanted to stay open, you know, to God in case there was a problem. And one day I was uh, at, a, at a church where they were giving out Bibles. They had a whole rack of them. So I, I grabbed a, a different version of the Bible, a different version than the one I, that I've been growing up with and familiar with, which is the uh, authorized version, also known as the King James Bible. And anyways, I'm quite familiar with, with Romans 8, verse 1. And in that verse, it says, There is therefore now no condemnation to those who are in Christ Jesus, who walk not after the flesh, but after the Spirit. All right? Now, in other versions, they don't have the second part of that. It says, like, here's one. Here's one uh, that... This is a Gideon Testament, but fortunately the Gideon's organization doesn't hand out these kind anymore. This is a, a revised Berkeley edition, which I never even heard of before I found this. And I'll never give this one away. In fact, I'm going to write in the front of it, and, and uh, just in case for the sake of those who might find this after the rapture, let them know that you know if they want to if they want to read the truth, don't read this one. All right? You're saying, but how can you say that? That's that's the Bible, isn't it? No, this isn't the Bible. This is this is. Uh, a shadow of the Bible, if you even want to call it that. I don't even believe it's that close to God's Word. But this here says, There is therefore now no condemnation to those who are in Christ Jesus, and then goes right straight to the second verse. See, it says right there. It doesn't show you the second part of the verse. And that is wrong. That's wrong. All right, now now why is that uh, that part of that verse missing? I'll tell you why. Because the devil doesn't want us to know this. He doesn't want us to know that our condemnation is, uh, you know, if we walk according to the flesh, that we're condemned. But if we don't, because we're in Christ Jesus and we don't do that, we're not condemned. Because uh, we're free through Christ now. Now, I'm going to have some other YouTube videos where I present one idea toward these things. These are things that God has shown me. I'm not going to venture off into something that I'm unfamiliar with, but I'm going to talk to you about the things that God has shown me personally. So you know I'm not just fluffing off the top of my head. Plus, you know, there's a lot of people that, that make these arguments about the versions, and they never mention any scripture. I mean, how can you do that? <laughs> the, the Word of God stands up for himself. Hey, I'll tell you, there's a good guy on YouTube. You might want to check out his videos also. His name is Calcium Boy. But keep checking my videos because they'll have more thoughts on these things in the days to come. Thanks for watching. Also, I'd be very remiss if I didn't tell you, God has provided a way of salvation for you. If you want to know how to get to heaven, if you want to live with God eternally like he originally created us to do, the Bible tells us how to do that. And it's very simple. You confess Christ as Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead and you will be saved. Thanks for watching.